Hello, my friend. My name is Terry Petrovic. Uh, thanks for stopping by today. You know, for the past 25 plus years, I've been teaching, coaching, and training people how to create a better quality of life, primarily in the network marketing profession. Uh, primarily in wellness. I love uh, staying young, looking young, feeling young. It's kind of the way I roll. Hey, Leslie, how are you? I'm 61 years old today, and I got to tell you, I feel amazing. Uh, I've never been on any medica medications or pharmaceuticals, and uh, that's the way I want it to stay. I want to talk to those of you who are in a health and wellness company. Hey, Karen, how are you? Welcome. Um, a lot of times, uh, because we're not trained properly, it's not your fault, uh, our companies tell us to uh, promote our product, whatever our product is, uh, whatever our business is. You know, there's a gazillion health and wellness companies out there, and everybody thinks they have the best health and wellness company out there. <laughs> with the best products. Hey, Kelly, how are you? Here's what I want you to understand, and here's what I want you to know. Um, there's a couple basic fundamentals that uh, will make you a whole lot more attractive. A big mistake people make, and this is primarily because their company tells them to do this, is post information about your products on your wall. Talk about the ingredients. Talk about how amazing is it. Talk about, you know, uh, why you got started and, you know, hold the product up and, I got to tell you, when you do that, it's a big commercial, and it's like having verbal diarrhea all over people. <laughs> Nobody wants to be pitched like that. Now, <clears throat> I'm not saying, because I had this conversation with somebody this morning, um, we've been in the same health and wellness company for, gosh, over 20 years. Uh, neither one of us are building it, but we love the product. Talk about the benefits of the product. Talk about what's in it for the prospect or the viewer or your friend, the person who's scrolling, 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 and they see you and if they go to your profile and if it's a pitch fest, you're probably not going to uh, get them as a new friend. Why? It's because you're spammy. It's because you're pitch, pitch, pitch. You know, Facebook is about relationships. There's 2 billion people on Facebook now. Uh, there's a reason for that. People want to connect with like-minded people. So if you want to post things, post things that are uh, inspiring, post things that help people grow their business if they're in a network marketing or home-based business. Don't post information about your bottles and products. It's, it doesn't work. Uh, I met, uh, actually made two new friends, hopefully they're still friends, <laughs> on Facebook this morning. Uh, I basically accepted their friend request, say, hey, how you doing, nice to meet you, what's going on? Uh, one person sent me three links about what she's doing. I mean, it's like, bam, I'd love for you to join my team, LOL. <laughs> I just sent her a GIF back, and I just started laughing. I'm like, are you kidding me? Are you serious? My guess is that she's relatively new in the industry. I've been around for decades. I'm an old dog. I've been pitched by everybody, by everything. I'm all the latest, greatest products, and I love wellness products. But the first interaction you have with people should never be – I'm going to pitch you on my stuff. Somebody else sent me uh, information. Hey, how you doing? Uh, I sent that to them. I accepted their connection request. Uh, hey, how you doing? What you going on? And I'm working with, um, you know, this, this amazing company. Have you ever heard of it? I haven't. Turns out I had, but I didn't. So I Googled it. And I just did their company name or was a product name slash reviews. What comes up? Hey, D, how are you? What comes up is all the negative stuff all the negative stuff. Now, I know if you're in a health and wellness company, that's not the desired outcome that you want. Uh, for this person, I actually found their product on Amazon and it had like three and a half stars. Not so good. When you're excited about a product, you want to communicate the benefits of that product to your base, your tribe, your followers, your friends, your family. And oh, by the way, if you constantly post about your product on there, uh, you're going to turn a bunch of people off, including your family and friends. So you might want to consider that. And it's not your fault because that's the way, unfortunately, most network marketing companies train. If you are interested in how to get leads on Facebook for free, hey, Carmen, how are you? Uh, if you want to learn how to get leads on Facebook for free, um, I've got a free training I can send to you. Just type yes below and I'll send it over to you and you can you can go through it. It's all value-based. It's all generic. But the thing about it is it's going to make you attractive to your ideal prospect. 
You see, nobody likes to be sold. Uh, nobody likes to be hyped or pitched. Uh, but everybody likes to buy. I know I do, and I'm sure you do as well. So what we have to do is we have to create curiosity, and that's a key thing right there. If you're paying attention to nothing other than what I said right there, create curiosity in your post. Make the person reach out to you and say, oh, my gosh, uh, I can't believe your arthritis has gone so fast. What are you using? How'd that work? See, when you create curiosity like that and you don't tell them the product, they're going to reach out to you and say, hey, tell me what you're doing because my fingers are killing me and my knees are killing me. I'd love to be able to get rid of my pain. What's working for you? Now you have a prospect who's coming to you as an expert who's got results and that can help them. See, that's the distinction is that all too often, and, and Facebook is amazing for building your business, and it's horrible for building your business all at the same time. <laughs> uh, it's horrible because most people aren't trained and they do it all wrong. <laughs> it's wonderful for doing a business because you really can make new friends every day. You can find out who your ideal prospects are. You can have them reach out to you. You can help them and understand that we're in the business of solving problems, guys. We're not in the business of pitching products or opportunity. You never want to send anybody a link unless they ask you, will you send me some information? Or you can ask them, hey, if this sounds good, would you like me to send you some information? Happy to do that. Very similar to what I said earlier. Hey, if you want to know how to get free leads on Facebook, type yes below and I'll send you a free training. So I'm not posting my link out there anywhere. I'm saying, hey, if you want some value, and oh, by the way, this is pure value, and that's another thing you need to be aware about. You know, a lot of times people are push, push, push in terms of their product and opportunity, and they never really give any value to their community. But when you give value, we can offer training, whether you do it or somebody else does it, and that training is valuable, and it helps your prospects or your followers uh, improve their sales or improves their business or improves their van, their brand, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Hello, Gene, how are you? Uh, so make note of it, uh, be aware of the information that you post. Again, don't post anything about your physical product. Uh, don't post anything about your company and your company's probably not gonna like that and your company's leaders, depending on who they are, they're gonna tell you is, Oh, we're doing a promotion, so everybody post on their on their uh, Facebook and on their Instagram and on LinkedIn that this product is available for you know twenty percent off or whatever it is. Yeah, nobody wants to be pitched like that, guys. People want to be informed. They want to be educated, and if they have a problem and you talk about the benefits of your product and it can solve their problem, they're gonna reach out and they're gonna say, hey, tell me about what your stuff is because I wanna know about it. That, my friends, is what we call attraction marketing. And if you've never really um, studied attraction marketing, if you don't uh, know how that works, um, I have a four-day training that I did that talks about, number one, how do you have the right mindset uh, as a marketer, uh, how do you define your ideal target market? Uh, what do you need to be doing every day in and out and how you can generate leads for yourself? If that's attractive to you, just type attraction marketing below and I'll get you access to that free training. Again, it's all free. It's all value based. Nothing to sell there at all. I know after 25 years in this profession, when we bring value to the marketplace, then we can create a following. The whole goal is to build an audience, engage with that audience, and then serve that audience. You see, when you do all three of those things consistently and you do them well, the money hunts you down. You have to build an audience. You have to position yourself as a leader, somebody that has value and brings value. Then you have to engage with your following, uh, answer their questions, be a friend. You know, <laughs> I... Uh, Going through this course, I did it 34 years ago, How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie. Um, 34 years ago, I took this. Back in 1983, I'm doing it again. Why? Because the number one skill we really need more than anything else is our human relation skills, our ability to connect with people. 
And when you get on the phone and you talk to people and you understand what their struggles are and what their pains are and what their problems are, then maybe you can help them. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. You know, we can't certainly help everybody. Just because you have skin, that doesn't necessarily mean you would want a skincare product if I was selling a skincare product. And a lot of companies, I've heard it said this before from the main stage, if you're in a skincare product uh, in a company, uh, who's your target market? Anybody with skin. <laughs> and that is like 80% wrong right there <laughs> because a lot of people don't care. So what happens is uh, somebody offered to send me a sample today. I could have said yes, but I'm like, don't waste your money because I'm not really interested in what you have. Not to say that it's not a bad product, but I'm good. I'm good. So make sure that you really take this to heart. Uh, share this with some of your friends who are maybe on your team who are doing it the wrong way. Try it for a month. Don't post anything about your product with an image. Post about the benefits of your product and how it can solve a problem. Now you're going to get somebody's attention. Now people are going to be reaching out to you. My name is Terry Petrovic. Remember this, my friend. You have a choice. Make it a better than terrific day and a prosperous one. You absolutely deserve it. And remember, if you want the Facebook training, type yes. If you want the four-day attraction marketing training, just comment attraction marketing. Take care until we talk again. Bye-bye for now. Oh, I didn't tell you guys that I love you. I do. I love, I love my tribe. So if I can help you in any way, if you have any questions about anything, I'll just give you my phone number right now. Most of you guys will never call me, so I'm cool with it. But if you want to talk to me about attraction marketing, how to get leads for free on Facebook or you know, YouTube or LinkedIn, let's have that conversation. My phone number, 919-624-0544, 919-624-0544. Four, four. Four, four. Make it a better than terrific day, guys. Have a great weekend. Talk to you soon. Bye now.